YouTube and welcome to Recently on the Tubes. I'm your host, Rod Walton, and it's time to log in, click on, and tube out. Episode 36. Well, technology is the driving force behind YouTube, and behind every great gizmo is a gadget review. Today we turn to Periaban with his Android Reality Pad. This is the, uh, oh yeah, this is the new reality pad from Android. Have you seen this, the new Android reality pad? Man, this is the best thing ever. Look, you can actually, you can actually manipulate reality via the pad and it's, you know, it's completely see-through so that you can, you can work the controls on the back there like that. This is the best tablet to get. It's black, the bezel is black, has extra grip on the side here. You can use it up, you can use it in portrait, like so. You can rest it on your knee, you can use it in landscape, you can hold it there. You can practically roll it up. I haven't tried to roll it up, but I have heard reports that you can roll it up and stick it in your pocket. And it's just, look at the graphics, look at the graphics, you know. Look at the graphics on this thing. They're just like reality. It's just, it's just like being there. On the tubes, a team of highly trained monkeys do stand-up comedy and other internet tasks. Over to you, Hate Me Productions. I was married for about five years. Yep, five years. And they say you learn a lot being married to somebody. And I gotta tell you, I, one of the only things that I learned was that there's something more disgusting than a really stinky fart. There is. And that is one that smells good and makes you a little hungry. Okay, well it's time to catch up with Dick Chain uh, Cranium from the Wacky World Newsroom. Uh, John Thomas, are you there? Richard Cranium with your Wacky World News report. Reporting the latest Saga, drama, and entertainment here on YouTube. Just the top story, thanks, John. Our top story for today, the ducks quacks back, was injured today when she went out on a surfing spree, cruise with fellow birds on the Racket River, located in upstate New York. Now let's get the latest weather forecast from Lemmy Sinclair. Uh, uh, no, no, uh, sorry, there's some things that are just too hot for YouTube. Um, just wrap it up, thanks, uh, John. This has been the latest Wacky World News Report. Richard Cranium reporting. <laughs> I'm Kensington 25 and you're watching Rot. <laughs> It's now time for our OMG moment. Moldy? OMG! Oh my god. OMG! Thanks, Moldy, and that's right, our OMG moment comes from Melinda Gilman. Let's check out a little bit more of her. Oh my god! It's man eaters! Man eaters! <laughs> man eaters! It's a wonder that one right there is alive. That poor little thing had maggots eating inside of its little body. I know, because I'm the one that squeezed them out. Givadon has put me in her box. Has she gone completely mad? I'm crazy. I've gone crazy today. <laughs> it's made me crazy. Excuse me while I get undressed to go to the pool. Bye. Hello? 
Z. Oh, I see. Right, thanks. Bye, Z. I crack myself. Uh, we now cross to Z for a three foot shout out. of Bondi in Sydney and what a day it is here in Australia let me tell you and look on the, I've got a bit of a job to uh, let myself be heard over the, the noise of the sand and the surf and I'm kind of kicking myself that I didn't bring a fish eye today so that you could see me in panoramic but still I have a shout out to do and the, the first shout out I'd like to do is for Pappy Stew. Pappy Stew big shout out for you look where I am down at Bondi Beach. Yes, yes, Pappy Stu knows what to do, but what would he do with this? Well, that little clip came from Mean Miss C, and speaking of Mean Miss C, she can find love in every nosebleed. Productions channel teaches us a few tips of survival. That was a bit of a hairy landing, but I've had worse. Halfway up the hill, a rabbit runs out from right underneath my feet. As a good indication that there is food to be had here, it's just a question of finding it. No good to drink. Find something else. I don't want to get sick, so hopefully a better source is nearby. Could be full of animal excrement or anything. There's so many bacteria, you can't be too careful. Until I find a clean water source, urine is all I've got. Oh, there's a couple of woodlouse. There's one. I've got three. I've got another couple here as well. I don't really want to eat them alive. Squash them. That's it, they're not moving. Right, perfectly edible. Woodlouse pound for pound is just like eating beef. Packed with protein and they won't kill you. Gross. <laughs> Next clip goes to show you that even in daytime, nighttime can produce bubbles. Roaming reporter Angie112277 with her entertainment update. Could you stop doing that, please? Yes, I went and saw the best movie of the summer uh, last night, Transformers 3, and I'm here to give you a quick review about it. Um, basically, um, awesome uh, special effects, uh, all the awesome Michael Bay stuff. Um, but you know what, what begs the question for me is, you know, there's like 50 trillion Decepticons and then there's only like, um, I don't know, like 10 Autobots, I mean, what the heck, um, they should, uh, bring Megan Fox back, uh, to be, uh, Optimus Prime's girlfriend and maybe they could make, uh, mate together and, uh, produce some more Autobots. Who knows? So anyway, 
I recommend full price. Go to the movies, pay full price, but never pay full price for popcorn. And this has been Angie, your rock reporter, signing out. <laughs>in Capitals competition is on once more. That's right, if you put your comments in Capitals down below where the comments go in the last episode, then you'll be in the draw to win yourself uh, an official rock sticker pack today, which I'll be drawing now. So uh, while I'm doing that, if you want to put your comments in Capitals down below where the comments go, you'll go into the draw to find yourself a... Uh, 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 you could win a, a sticker pack in the next episode, right? So here we have the entrance uh, of last episode. We have Give It On. She's always here. Uh, Messenger Larry. Messenger Larry. Uh, the Del Delisa Productions and uh, the Naked Vombat, um, Luke Tube 2009, he's been here a while, Timothy Stein, always here, and my Aussie Day, Mad. Okay, let's see which one of you guys have, or girls have won yourself a official rod sticker pack. I don't have too many this time, so let's see. The Naked Wombat! You have won yourself the first official Rot Sticker Pack for today's episode and Luke Tube 2009. Congratulations, uh, guys. You've, uh, you've done well to win yourself a pack there. And like I said for everybody else who'd like to enter that competition, just put your comments in capitals down below where the comments go. Now, also, if you'd like to put Rot in your box and let me know that you've done so, I might be inclined to feature you on this show. So, go do that. All right, that about wraps it up for today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. And for uh, everybody that uh, is sitting there at home, I'll catch you all on the tubes. You know, now you're, 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 you're all going to want one, aren't you? I mean, no buttons. The battery lasts forever. Very, very, very high definition. This is a, it's a magical experience, actually. Very, very magical experience.